A very good morning. Welcome to Perspective, a program where we discuss all that is making news in the national, international business and sports arena. I'm Natasha Jha Bhaskar. So in the host segment, we'll discuss the national news. And to tell us more on national and international news, I have with me political journalist K.G. Suresh. Thanks very much, Mr. Suresh, for joining us in this program. So, I'm seeing the other uh, Samajwadi party is externally supporting UPA, but he has said that UPA government is directionless and Samajwadi party will oppose mm -hmm. any such policy where the government fails to cater to people. How are you reading Then this? why is he supporting it in the first place? The thing is that he was omnipresent uh, during the, you know, third dinner, third anniversary dinner of the UPA too. And uh, he has been in a way bailing out this government even in, in the parliament. So, uh, you know, whether it is the Lokpal issue or other issues, he has been, his party has been supporting. I think that Mulayam is trying to ha have the cake and eat it too. You see, on the one hand, he is supporting the government so that he can extract maximum, uh, you know, support for the for his son's government in UP, right, on the one hand. And on the other, he is trying to, you know, get maximum number of seats in the Lok Sabha. Uh, you know, he has set his eyes on say about 60 seats and uh, he, uh, you know, he can see his uh, double speak not only in this matter. Now he is in Kolkata for the national executive of the party. There he is praising both Jyoti Basu and uh, uh, Mamta Banerjee. So, uh, yeah, he is trying to... Uh, he, uh, I think, no, I think that he, is go, he thinks that he will benefit from this confusion, you know, mm -hmm. because the third front is an experiment he also knows. He himself has ridiculed that concept long time back. But now he is adopting it in the hope. Now, you see, the entire game is for 2014. 2014, as much as seats, because he has a fear that the image of corruption and things that uh, you know taint may hurt his proximity to Congress, it may get hurt in the electoral results. So he is maintaining, you know, he is criticizing. At the same time, because he wants his son to succeed in UP, he wants the largest of the central government, he wants to, you know, maintain good relations with the center. So also, I think that he wants, is, wants to tell the people that, you know, we are against the coal, uh, uh, coal scam, yes. coal gate scam, the government might not yes. call it a scam, but yeah. uh, we are very much against uh, go, uh, the government's take on this and we yes. are in for Yeah, he is trying to, uh, that's what, you know, he is trying to do a balancing act but uh, uh, it remains to be seen how much he will succeed because you know people are intelligent enough to see through the whole thing uh, because uh, uh, now he is trying to I mean how can he have a third front uh, with uh, you know will Mayavati be part of the third front now these are questions you know that needs to be I mean he here he is supporting the UPA government along with Mayavati so this and is all they are better politics I think that, that is this is all politics right. being played I don't think much of uh, principles or ideology is at stake here right so th <laughs> they are not principled allies they are not principal <laughs> foes also thanks very much Mr. Suresh for joining pleasure. us in this program